Hi guys, welcome to Teach to Code. I'm Suraj here today. We will start our game development series and here is the first part of that. If you wonder how to make game, then you should check out this site. We are going to make our game in Unity 3D, which is the most popular package that is available. And all the popular indie games are from Unity 3D. It's really simple. If you have the logics and interest in game making, then you can individually build a great game. So for downloading, and the Unity 3D you can go for unity3d.com and here you can see all the details about the Unity 3D and the game that is already made in Unity 3D and there is an active community for Unity 3D so if you are struck in anything don't worry you come to their forum and post your question and that's it and here you can see all the stuffs and for downloading you can go to here and download and it's free it comes with two version, one is pro version and another one is free version and free version is very good. It has all the options except some unity assets. You can go over there and uh, you can check out the difference and I will use the unity free package over here, download and install and you are ready to go. No much big setups. Okay, after download, I will take my application over here and here is the interface of unity 3d and if you want to create a new project then you can go for file then click on new project and if you want to import some packages then you can check these checkboxes I will talk about the packages or assets later and I will start from the row okay so that I will browse my package directory and I will save here and you should select the folder select the folder then click on create and you are ready to go don't save and it will open with the new project and here is our new project with a blank scene file welcome to unity 3d and here is the message and here you can see the interface if you are familiar with Maya or 3ds max or any other 3d application then you will be familiar with this layout okay if you press the alt key in your keyboard and press the left button of your mouse and Simon then instantly you can navigate to the viewport if you are a 3d max or Maya user then it will be easy for you because you have to learn if you have to make a good games then you have to learn some 3d packages because unity 3d is for only integrating you can use the programming within the unity 3d and you can import assets from other 3d applications but you can't make anything great in 3d unity 3d i mean modeling or animation or something kind of like that and here is the uh, hierarchy you can undock these tabs and you can place in any place that you like and here is the project and here is the console and here you can display messages like that and here is the uh, project inspector and here is the main camera and all the elements or stuffs are displayed over here and here is our camera and now it's 2d if you click on 2d then it will go for 2d mode and if you are preferring 2d game making then you can you use unity 2d game engine functionality but i'm gonna go into use the 3d so click again then it will be turning to 3d and here is the fx and here is the assets you can import package i will tell you about later about the packages and here is the game ob objects that you can create then component you can create any component you can create physics material this body etc and here's the window okay first of all this is the main interface of unity 3d and if you want to create something then you can go for game object and it's good to create a prototype before you are creating actual game so it's good for creating prototype if you are going to uh, come on and menu and here you can see the meshes you can add meshes and in the game object you can create other 
click on create other you can create other 3d objects cube sphere or capsule cylinder plane quad I, if i click cube then it will be create a cube over here and here in the inspector menu it will display all the properties of the cube and you can tweak the settings over here you can position you can change the position here and if you are if you want to apply another material then you can add the material and if you click on here and you can select the color etc here is a three axis and if i click and drag then it will be go to left and it is 3d it is not 2d 3d means it has z axis x y z if you are in 2d game making then it will be have only two axis that is x and y that is vertical and horizontal okay and here is if you want to make your cube bigger you can use two ways the first one is you can click on here that is the scale tool and you can drag to any axis and it will be scale into that axis or you can scale it proportionally by go over here and say change the value then you can easily change the value over here you can see the position here you can like this you can do like this okay and it's a box collider that is attaching with them i will talk about the colliders later and here is the basic stuff that you can use with unity 3d and if i click play you can see the cube over here if i press run you can see the the rendered window over here that is the running mode and you can see our little cube over here we we didn't apply any light so it will be ugly and if you add shadows and uh, give some global illumination like something like that stuff then it will be more attractive so if i press this button again it will return to its editing mode and you can do editing here and here is the script menu you can add any assets you can create see hat scripts then you can add animation controller there are so much of stuff that you can do in unity 3d I will be going all of them and you will be get a good idea about how to do a game making so we will do some basic stuff in programming in the next classes because for game making it's very essential to do programming so there is no easy way there is easy way but um, no something like uh, drag and drop functionality you have to do some programming okay then we will start our programming class in the next lessons okay see you in the next class till then bye bye take care